And automatically, we've got we right now. Wrath is playing Bayonetta like right away. So we've got we've got a Bayonetta versus a Pikachu. You know what's really exciting about this is that I get to see some stuff <laughs> that I don't normally get to see, and also I wonder how Bayonetta plays in latency. You know what I mean? Because there will be a little bit of latency. In latency, I want to see like against Pikachu and like on top tiers. And that yeah. Stuff. So anyway, with, that has a nice, really, really nice low hitbox there on I think the side B. Um, I haven't played this character enough to know. That's a really nice low hitbox to hit uh, characters like Pikachu. Mm -hmm. um, so right now both players just doing what they normally do, feeling each other out in the neutral. Gonna put that on a t-shirt. Really am gonna put that on a t-shirt, because eventually everyone's gonna love it. Um, but right now, um, Wrath gets some solid damage. Solid damage out of Bayonetta right now. Uh, Proctavia looking a little bit uh, uncomfortable with the matchup, not really acting as much. Gets a good quick attack there, but no up to follow-ups. And Wrath just kind of, uh, like like Wrath said, not going easy on anybody at all here. Um, trying to play as hard as technically possible. Uh, it looks like the connection's good, though. It does. I don't think they're playing in Jelly. I think it looks good. Nice, uh, witch time. No, that's... She has a special thing about her... Like, yeah, I know what dodge. it is, yeah. So, if you... Oh my hit, god! <laughs> and if then... you get hit in the late frames of an air dodge, you take half the damage, but still get away without any of the knockbacks. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. Anyway, what a what a raw forward smash. It's just it's it's exciting to see a giant demon fist hit Pikachu for some reason. Yeah. I'm not I'm not I'm not trying to get off the topic of the commentary and everything, but it's just it's really exciting to watch that happen. But right now, um, Wrath sitting at a really high lead tries to go for a complete follow up. We didn't get a punish on that at all. Um, just really holding down the stage, keeping his stage presence alive, uh, not really letting uh, Proctavia get anything started right now. Proctavia looking like he's just having trouble. Um, Securing any of those high damage um, Pikachu combos, and uh, Wrath actually uh, had time to go for the balloon and got it. So um, going for that uh, down that downer spike uh, on the ledge there, kind of like a like a pink thing. It doesn't sense. Have a spike. Yeah, it, it also kills it stupid early percent. Okay. And right now Wrath just holding down the stage, not being too impatient or anything like that, not heading off. Um, it's a nice back air right there. Octavia's got a lot of work to do if he's going to clean this up. Um, he's playing very, kind of slow right now. Where did that down B come from? <laughs> and gets another down B right there. So he actually ends up taking a stock on, on Wrath. Wrath probably, uh... Oh my god, Wrath going really hard for those smash attacks. Going for hard reads right now. Um, Banner's recovery is really clean. I wouldn't say it's great, but I'd say it's really clean. No, it is actually really good. What's up, Zgrid? Um, again, thanks for the follow, man. Appreciate it. Uh, guess that little was that, that that's on the side step too, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. All right. I should have probably did my research before this so that I knew what I was talking about. Um, she's brand new. But she's brand I'm, new. Nobody's gonna play it. Oh, uh, nice witch time right there. Tries to get an up smash out of it. Uh, it looks like right now Wrath is just kind of. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say it right now in any disrespect to Proctavia, but Wrath, you can't play with your food, man. Because if you play with your food, you won't get dessert. Okay. So, finish your plate, boy. Is all I gotta say about that. <laughs> Um, I guess they're just playing in the neutral right now. Uh, connection looks pretty clean. I mean, we've seen a couple spikes here and there, but nothing too bad. Uh, the rest of the players are right now playing their matches at this, uh, C2 CEO Season 2 League 1. Nice back air right there. Falling back air. A little Samus E right there to take that match at 60% with one stock left. So, first match is gonna go to Wrath. Um. Oh, so, um, Wrath playing that Orange Sonic right now. Going to Lilat, which, uh... Which um, is a Proctavia's counter pick, which is interesting. I actually would I actually don't mind the stage at all as a Sonic player. Uh, I'm not, but as I've seen Sonic players play it, I actually don't think they mind this at all because they get very safe options on side B and down B into up B using the platforms. I haven't given her enough time um, as here, and I probably won't truthfully because she doesn't really fit my play style very well. Um, but uh, it is not, It is refreshing to see people who are doing good things with the characters. Uh, I know you probably remember Pethos. Uh, Pethos has been playing a lot of Corn lately. It's going to be exciting to see what um, what he's figured out with Corn too. Right now, um, see how see how you can just use the up platform. Uh, you can use the top platform for an up and you can down air into the bottom of the stage, basically, and just be free on it. So uh, right now, uh, Wrath just overwhelming this Pikachu player um, right now with Sonic. And I think he switched to, uh, not only switched to Sonic for the sake of, like, I don't know, 
Maybe because he didn't like that stock being taken off of him. Maybe because he wants to get a little warm up with the character too before he actually gets deeper into the tournament. It, either way, it's working out for him right now. Sitting at 25%. Uh, Proctavius sitting at 112%. Um, still just just not doesn't seem able to get really much down there. Goes for a nice hard lead forward smash and actually ends up getting it. Ooh, nice side B into uh, the up air there. I wonder what he's going to get a kill on. Probably going to get like a raw forward smash kill. Again, at the more I've been watching Sonic players play and watching Static Manny and everything, it just makes me want to play the character. It really does. Just out of the pure, like, the mobility is really nice. The, um, the not campy nature, but just the in and out ducking nature seems really nice. So, we'll see what he gets out of it. Ooh, nice forward smash right there by, um, by Barcadia. He's gonna have to go for he's gonna have to go for like a hard forward smash read here or get something off the top or maybe at this percent maybe a forward throw would kill um, more than likely getting some lag spikes here. Um, oof. I'm actually taking a serious dive right now. Not entirely sure why. Doesn't matter. He's handling it. Get some up throw and actually up throw kills too. Getting some serious lag here. I've got zero drop frames over here, so it's gotta be on their end. I want to say. But it looks like both players are playing out, and it just cleaned itself up, so everything's good now. So strange. Nintendo Network. So Plus, Kristen probably tried one. Anyway. Um, nice back air right there. Good shield by Proctavia. Uh, Calam uh, Calamity. Wrath. <laughs> Damn tags. Uh, Wrath getting a lot of extra credit right now. So much extra credit, he might be able to gra just graduate without, without even honors. He might just pass him up because they just know he's so good. You know, we'll, um, what do they call that? Uh, advancing a grade? Yep. Yeah. Oh, skipping a grade, who cares? Anyway. <laughs> uh, both players just navigating the lag real hard right now. Proctavia and Wrath having some issues with it, but right now, I don't know if it really matters that much. Wrath has such a commanding lead over this matchup in general, um, and over these, over the last match and this match, that I don't think it's really going to make much of a difference. I mean, he has a, he has a, not only a stock lead, but he also has a percent lead right now, so I don't see it really changing much of the outcome in this game. Octavia also moving kind of slow, uh, regardless of the lag, so goes for a back air there. Um, Wrath getting set, looking, looks like he's going for a hard read, but he's just playing really safe. Even when he can go for hard reads with Force Smash, even if they're going to be safe, he's just deciding to play safe and just rack up a bunch of percentage, you know, and not really go for anything risky. As you can see, just going for the easy stuff here. Um, just has such a really nice pivot grab right there. Goes for an up throw and going to kill again. And Lilat actually has a, um, a low ceiling too, so... Yeah. Um, we're just getting the kill with up there right there. So, 